that when- there is no question that there will be a challenge to the coming administration in the arena of infectious diseases, both chronic infectious diseases in the sense of already ongoing disease, and we have certainly a large burden of that, but also there will be a surprise outbreak. There will be a surprise outbreak. There will be a surprise outbreak. with why Georgetown and D.C. The reason why is because Anthony Fauci said on January 10th, 2017 at Georgetown that there would be a surprise outbreak and pandemic under Trump at a conference at Georgetown, which was about pandemic preparedness. And you have to keep in mind, Anthony Fauci is a Jesuit himself, just like Georgetown is the nation's first Jesuit university. The other thing is the coronavirus outbreak simulation event 201, it was not called 201 by accident. And there's two major clues that event 201 was named by the Jesuits who very much appear to be behind this agenda. And again, understand when we get to this rally, it doesn't have to be about Gematria. I just want people to understand if we're going to call out the agenda, we need to call out who's actually responsible. Someone like Brian from High Impact Vlogs, I'd love for him to bring his following to this event. But Brian keeps blaming the Federal Reserve and saying they're who's behind it. Sort of. The Federal Reserve is definitely part of the problem, but it is the Jesuits who are behind this agenda and it is them that need to be exposed. Again, Event 201. What does that number have to do with the Jesuits? Well, for starters, look no further than the first publicly Jesuit pope, who's the current pope, Pope Francis, who's the first ever pope to live in suite 201. And at this gathering, we can teach about gematria. I'm hoping speakers like Robert Kennedy will come there, Dell Bigtree, people who have a lot of information about vaccinations. But gematria is a very simple subject, and it proves a lot. And again, not to toot my own horn, but there's no one in this truth community in the last seven years who's exposed more, connected more dots, called more events before they happen, and it's all because of this code. It also seems like why the whole truth community is missing who's responsible for this agenda. People see the agenda, but they're blaming the puppets and not really getting at the root of who's behind this, which is the Jesuits. But look, Ignatius of Loyola is the founder of the Jesuits. His name equals 201. Pope Francis' birth name is Jorge Mario Bergoglio. His name is 201. Again, he's the first Jesuit pope, the first ever to live in suite 201 at the Vatican. And the name of that room is the Domus Sancte Marte, which equals 201. This is not an accident. Again, you go back in history. The Jesuits were banned by the Pope, and the Jesuits served the Catholic Church and the Pope, but they were so bad that the Pope had to ban them July 21st, 1773, and that could have been the end of the Jesuits, but the story is that Catherine the Great of Russia had just annexed Poland, and with it she had 201 Jesuits, and she protected them from the Pope's order, orders so they could carry on with their work in what was then Russia, and it was 201 Jesuits she saved. And of course, her husband died by arsenic poisoning, what the Jesuits are known for killing their victims with. Poisoning, vaccines. If you haven't read my new book, a lot of information about the agendas, the Jesuits, way more to this code. But understand, 201, big number of the Jesuits. And, um, you know, it's not an accident that things like the Twilight Zone equal 201. It's also not an accident that everywhere right now, if you're paying attention to what's being put before your eyes on screens, there's 201s everywhere. Brand new show on Netflix about a pandemic that turns the world into zombies. Where does it begin at? Apartment 201. This stuff is not an accident. The other day, somebody sent me a news clip from CNN, people being evicted because of coronavirus. What apartment number do they go to for the story? They go to an apartment number 201. Again, we've been documenting all of these 20 run rituals non stop. People need to stop and research the Jesuits, the history, what's been written about them for centuries, how sinister they are, how their goal is world domination on behalf of the Catholic Church. And with regards to event 201 being the coronavirus outbreak simulation and happening the exact same day that the military world games began in Wuhan, China, 
Don't forget the military world games trace back to Rome, where the Jesuits roam. All roads lead to Rome. And they trace back to the year 95. The military world games began in 1995 in Rome. The Jesuits were created to counter the 95 theses written exposing the corruption of the Catholic Church. And that's why the Jesuits were recognized by Rome on September 27th, the day leaving 95 days left in the year. So, 